missed that thing, didn't I? Got him that time. Morning, everybody. Jason, Hollis Farms. Pretty good morning so far. Got in about a four mile walk with Sissy. Come back. Got ready to go coming out the driveway and I saw that armadillo yesterday. It didn't stop. Them things is just about as bad as a hog. You get enough of them things, I have seen them just dang near root up a clover field. Just make a dadgum mess. But that one won't be making no mess no more. So, little armadillo hunting this morning with the little Henry. I sure smooth missed him the first time holding his camera and all. I had to concentrate that second time, but he was all four feet up when we got done. So, had some hog action last night. Mississippi. Oh, uh, I got a game camera up, one of my covert cameras up, and I've had a hog come through, I think two or three nights in a row. Looks like about a 150 pound boar hog. And at the panel trap, that sow come through that we had them five little ones that we got out of the way. She came through. And, uh, but didn't go in and then where we caught the big old spotted hog another big boar hog I'm assuming that's a boar hog big old single hog come through this morning about I think it was about four or so just before I got up he was all in the middle of the trap but then by the time I got up he was gone but anyway usually once they start you just gotta be patient you'll get them even if I had to go down there and freshen up the corn pile we'll get him so still got a few more I mean it's not a it's not just a pile of them you know like we had that big wad we caught over at mitts right where I'm trapping right now so uh, but it's gonna be some of these singles here and there so the trapping is gonna be a little harder had to be a little more patient uh, I still I have got to go over there and look at the spot where we caught so many last year we caught like 90 and one spot where it got so muddy through the winter uh, so I gotta go check that spot out I've been so busy doing other things I just hadn't got to there but I will probably gonna end up having to move a trap over there because I know we hadn't caught all them and if there is a bigger group somewhere uh, there uh, that's where they'll be but anyway I think I'm fixing the head. A little, still a little too wet. Probably do some bush hogging and stuff. Got to start back spraying here shortly. But anyway, I'm going over to the speed shop this morning and uh, try to do a little maintenance on the street stop. All right, y'all. I forgot to cut the camera on, but we just changed the transmission fluid. Don't do that very often, but got her changed. Like to keep fresh in there. Now we're checking some stuff on the rear end to make sure everything's good. Alright, gotta do a little gear changing. Worst thing about this street stock is you gotta pull this pumpkin out with a 9 inch forward late model and the modifier's got the quick change, just change them in the back. But it's part of it. We're gonna get it. I'll check out this contraption we're using now. We don't ever use this. Uh oh. Does pretty good unless you drop the plug in the Pan. No mess. Alright, got the other gear back in. Finna tighten the drive shaft up. Then we gotta see if we got some gear off. I think we may be out. Yeah. Boy, the funnel would be nice, wouldn't it? I might can hit that hook. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Nipple now. All right, y'all. Not just a ton going on today. I guess the biggest, most exciting action was the armadillo hunting and shooting this morning. It's always exciting to do that. Anyway, 
Got that done. Spent quite a bit of time on the on the uh, street stock. Didn't do a lot of video, and as y'all can see, it just bees like that sometimes. But anyway, I've watered the mules and horses. I've been out to feed these dogs, and I got some stuff I got to do this afternoon. Appreciate y'all watching. Out of here. Uh oh.